beautiful people. Hey, beautiful people. Welcome to my channel in the Notero 1122. All right, Gemini. So we're going to see what's coming towards you in September. All right. This is a general reading, so it will not resonate with everyone. Take what fits. Leave the rest. Feel free to check the other signs in your chart. And uh, yeah, uh, make sure you hit the like button for your girl too. Okay. All right, so let's see what's going on for Gemini. All right. Let's see what's coming up for Gemini. All right, Gemini. Uh, we really don't need to start off the month or a reading with the devil, okay? Um, yeah. <laughs> okay, so look, um, you have the devil, the eight of pentacles, and the seven of pentacles, okay? Um, and on the bottom of the deck, you have the hermit. Some of you might be obsessing about finding work, um, not being funny. Some of you may be spending a little bit more than what you have, and, um, yeah, you need to kind of cut that out. And if you're obsessing about work right here, uh, you need to cut that out too because everything is going to happen in divine timing, okay? Some of you, uh, not being funny, but some of you may be starting a new job because a job that you're, you're um, well, I was going to say attached to. The job that you have now, um, you literally have no freedom whatsoever. You feel trapped bound to this place okay so some of you actually will be starting new um new jobs starting fresh okay because yeah this person here is like literally like a puppet and it's like i can't take it no more in this place you know some of you actually may um really start working you know creatively at home you know, making your own products and things like that, you know, starting your own businesses and things, you know, starting from fresh. But yeah, I do see a new beginning when it comes to work, but you got to kind of stop obsessing over this situation, okay? Yeah, somebody is walking away from a job here. They are definitely walking away from a job. Slowly but surely, I think you're looking for something else or you're starting something else. You may be keeping it to yourself right now, but yeah, and you're possibly working, collaborating with somebody else on some type of project or, um, you know, have already landed another position or whatever and working with this person, like possibly giving you two weeks and they're working with you with your start dates or whatever. Hmm. All right, give me one more. Two of Cups. You're definitely collaborating with somebody, okay? Let's see, let's see, let's see. You're being very strategic about what you're doing. And like I said, you're keeping your business to yourself. Also, keep a hold on to your pinnacles as well, okay? Like I told you, I, I saw this. I saw it coming. All right, so you have a brand new beginning coming with your money. It may involve you, uh, it may, you may have to end up traveling somewhere or moving locations or something like that, you know? This also, some of you may, um, I don't know why I got this, but somebody may be buying products and stuff like that overseas. So you may be traveling to go get, you know, some of your, your merchandise or whatever. But yeah, you have a new beginning coming up when it comes to the pinnacles, okay? You're moving very, you know, moving like you should. Being careful, just mind your pinnacles. That's all I can tell you with that one. All right, I'm going to use these. Hopefully, I don't have any reversals. So, this should already be shuffled. Let's see, why is the devil here? Okay. Yeah, you're in your head about this situation. 
You are seriously stuck in your head about the situation, this job, this thing that you're doing. You're obsessing over it, trying to balance things out, working hard. Somebody is not, um, yeah, somebody's pissed off because, well, I won't say you pissed off, you and your feelings, because things that didn't work out like you had planned. So now someone is like, work, 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 and whatever it is, it's still not going the way that you want it. So you're trying to balance things out, but it's not going as planned. Okay. But I do believe you're going to turn around and realize there's other opportunities here for you. Okay. Don't cry over the spilt milk. There's nothing you can do about this situation. What you can do is tap into your creativity and make it work for you. Take that leap of faith in a new direction and start fresh, okay? Leave old things behind and start moving forward towards the projects and things that you want in your life because this is your life, the only one that you'll have for right now. So you might as well enjoy doing something that you love to do. And uh, start moving, open your mouth, and there's a partnership there for you to help you on along your way. Just, you know, keep moving like you're moving, you know, keeping your business to yourself, making smart business moves and prepare for that beginning. OK, keep a hold to your pinnacles and your information as well. It's only let out on a need to know basis. OK, so this does look pretty good for you. It's just a, a phase of transition. All right. Let's see. Why is the eight of pinnacles here? page of cups yeah see you're about to get some information too you're going to get some contact all right see there is somebody that wants to come in and work with you right there's somebody in somebody is going to come in and tell you that they want to work with you i think you have a great idea and yeah we should go ahead and do this i can help you you have a partnership on the way so yeah whatever this is um, you're not alone in this, so it's going to be okay to walk away from whatever the situation is. Yeah, because see, right now you're really in your head about it and decided and just like feel like you got carriage dangling in front of you, like you got to stay. It's a burden. Okay? So, yeah. You're going to be starting something new. I'm going to go ahead and put that right here. Anyway, hold on to your pinnacles like I told you, okay? Right now, you feel like you can't move. You can't do what you want to do. And for a minute, you're not going to be able to because your pinnacles are going to be a little bit, you know, because you're walking away from something, all right, to start something of your own. So your pinnacles are going to be a little sparse, and you never know. When you get in situations like that and you're doing your own thing, something always comes up unexpected. What did I tell you? Hold on to your pinnacles because something unexpected, something unexpected is going to come towards you, okay? All right. Yeah. All right. So let's see. Give me one more for the seven of pinnacles. <laughs> yeah. See, watch your money. Keep doing what you're doing. If you're spending money, make, sh make sure that you have something to show for it, like investing. If you're investing in your business or something like that, your products or whatever, make sure that, you know, it's some, your money is not being wasted, okay? There's going to be people, because I've, this is the second time I've seen this, you have the page of swords. So you have people watching what you're doing as well. And you may find that you may have to kind of, you know, not defend yourself, but kind of back some of these people off because they may have something to say. They may have their hands out. They may see you money, you know, buying money for products or starting stuff and, you know, doing your own thing. And then here they come. Okay. So just keep that in mind. Keep your guard up. Okay. All right. Because, yeah, you got money coming and there's somebody offering money for you, okay? It's a small beginning, but it's going to help you out. This may be somebody that wants to invest in your business or invest in your adventure. Or, you know, say like if you, you know, you may need a couple of thousand for training to learn how to do something to open your own business. This is the person that says, okay, you know what? Hey, I got half. You know what? I believe in you. We can, we can do this together. You never know, okay? Just be careful with this stuff, all right? 
be you know be mindful of what you do why is the two of cups here yeah <laughs> you're about to get some messages and somebody say hey let's go ahead let's do this i'll work with you it's going to be a good thing you're going to have a damn good outcome, okay? Come out shining for real. And this is going to be something that you're very passionate about, too. Something that you're going to love. Let's see. Why is the Seven of Swords here? Because ah, you're investing in yourself, taking your time, being strategic, doing what you got to do, saving your pinnacles, investing the pinnacles that you have. It's going to work out perfectly for you. I love it, love it, love it. What's the outcome, overall outcome for this situation for Gemini? Just don't obsess over it, okay? Don't obsess, obs obsess over it. Just keep doing what you're doing. That courage, don't get scared. Don't get scared. Keep it moving, keep it moving, keep it pushing. This is something that you love. It's going to work out. It's going to work out. Just make sure that you make good decisions. Not off of your emotions. Use logic, okay? So when it comes to, you know, your adventures or your ventures, whatever it is that you're trying to go into, be smart about it. Yeah, I love this. Oh, yeah, this is cool. This is cool. But see, this might cost you $10,000. OK, and it might not bring back the money that you spent to invest in it. OK, this is a smarter choice. So even though you got a lot of love for what you're doing, you got to be wise about it. OK. Don't get overzealous and just, yay, we, yeah, you know, but you do have stable beginnings coming, okay? Also, I do see that with this two of cups here, there's a possibility whoever you're collaborating with, this might be someone that you're already in a relationship with, or this may end up being someone that you're actually in a relationship with later on down the line. You guys vibe just like that, and you're, you're a pair, you're a match, okay? You vibe well together. So, with that being said, uh, yeah, this looks damn good, okay? So, you got a little bit of little bit of hang time, a little bit of wait time, okay? Look at things that, in a new perspective. Uh, don't stress out about it. So, whatever this is that you're leaving behind, you know, this, whatever's got you dangling, go ahead and, you know, when it's time for you, be smart. Don't walk away from your job because it says said walk away from your job. You know what I'm saying? Be smart about it. Strategic about this new beginning. Okay? So, yeah, it looks really, really good. I like it. Just move smart. And let's get some messages from Spirit. All right. And it says, acknowledge and learn from the past. So if there are some mistakes that you made from the past, like say like if you decided to open up a business before and, you know, you kind of didn't get your wholesale license, didn't get your uh, resale license, whatever it is, um, take the mistakes that you made from the past, make a little business Bible out of it and, you know, use that as a guideline as to what not to do. Okay. All right. Let's see. Then you have what you have been through can only make you stronger. The worst is over. That's good. Spirit is ready to offer you guidance. All you is required is an open mind and a request for assist assistance. Oh, my God. Yes. So ask and you shall receive. And then I want to get you one of these since career came up. Let's see what messages. Can I have one card, please? Just one. Thank you. All right, opportunities on the way. I lied. I want one more. <laughs> let me see. Okay, let me have one of these. All right, declutter. Create a sacred workspace that you love. Clutter keeps you stuck. Clear it and watch your creativity and abundance flow easily. Okay, so look. Um, if you haven't started your thing, your business, whatever this is, get started, okay? Make a space for you to do everything that you need to do for your, your projects or whatever. And then that way, when you go sit down, all you have to do is start working, okay? No excuses. But anyway, that's what I have for you. All right.